Coder versus Programmer How to tell the difference for recruitment When you look at a computer coder versus programmer, can you tell which one is which? It can often be rather difficult. After all, they both write computer code and produce technical output. But is everybody who writes computer code the same? Absolutely not and when hiring a coder versus programmer, getting the wrong one will land you in a major pickle. Why you need to know the difference between a coder versus programmer? Probably the most important situation in which you need to be able to tell the difference between a coder versus programmer is when you are trying to fill a position on a software development team. Not only do you need to fill the position with the right type of technical hire, you need to be able to understand your candidate's history to see if they have the right experience. What is a coder? Before you can compare a coder versus programmer, you need to ask what is a coder? Simply put, a coder is a person who can write code. Often on technical people will stop there and refer to all techies as coders. If that seems like a pretty all-encompassing definition, that is because it is. But it's important to remember that people who can do other things like plan and design programs in addition to writing code tend to identify themselves in different ways. Have you ever written a website? Done any raw HTML? Congratulations! You're technically a coder as HTML is still technically computer code even if it isn't a programming language. Of course, the title doesn't define what type of code the coder writes. This could be as simple as implementing a library, or it could be a more complex algorithm. Generally, to be a coder, someone has to have a basic understanding of the language they are writing in. That's usually where their independent knowledge ends. As Nirmal already puts it, a coder will probably still need to be instructed on what to do or what's intended to be accomplished, implemented, debugged, tested, and checked for quality assurance. Oftentimes, the coder won't even participate in writing a program. Instead, they simply write simple scripts to automate certain tasks. If this description seems to be describing a person with pretty basic knowledge, it's because it is. But once a coder learns how to do a little more, they become a computer programmer. What is a computer programmer? After asking what is a coder, you have to ask what is a computer programmer? If a coder is somebody blindly following a recipe to make a basic meal, a computer programmer is like a reasonably competent cook. While they do sometimes read some recipes, they're not stuck with only following other people's instructions. Oftentimes, before cooking, they will sit back and decide on what they want to make, what ingredients they want to use, and how they want to put them together. The thing is that programming involves more than just coding. Sure, programmers write computer code, but it's usually the last thing that they do. First, they need to think about what they're doing, what they want to create, and how they're going to create it. They then make a plan of the tools and resources that they're going to use and only then do they start coding. This means that when comparing a programmer versus coder, the skills a programmer uses are an evolution of the skills that a coder uses. Unlike a coder who is happy to just happy to put some code into their computer to perform a function, a programmer is expected to produce code which is clean and robust. What is the difference between seeing coder versus programmer on a CV? This will make your head explode. You can't actually make this comparison as coder doesn't really exist anymore as a position. It used to be that coder would be someone who translates very detailed design to C CSI or some other language. In the old IBM days, it was someone who did the bidding of the chief programmer who ran the development team. But those days are long gone and it's unheard of to see coder as a paying technical position. What positions can do more than a programmer? Developers and engineers. As we said, when you compare a programmer versus coder, a programmer is the competent chef who doesn't need to rely on recipes. But if you want a chef who can cook truly amazing food or run a kitchen at a top restaurant, you will need someone who can do a lot more. In the same way, you will need a software developer, engineer, or architect to create truly great software. To find out if your candidate has the skills of a coder or programmer, visit www.devskiller.com.